When people come across animals, they often feel the urge to touch them because of their cuteness, beauty, and uniqueness. However, there are certain animals that should never be touched as they can cause severe harm. These animals can attack with sharp force, cause parasitic infections, poison people, or transmit deadly diseases. In the video, I will be showing you the animals that you should avoid touching at all costs. Let's get started. Cone Snail Cone snails are not harmless creatures like ordinary snails. These gastropods have a striking appearance with bright colors and interesting shapes, but they are ruthless predators. They burrow into the sand, wait for prey, and strike with their harpoon. Their venom is incredibly powerful and can paralyze their prey instantly. Cone snails are not interested in humans, but if disturbed, they may shoot their harpoon at an impudent diver or swimmer who accidentally touches them. The harpoon pierces the skin and the venom spreads instantly. The geography cone is especially dangerous as its venom is powerful enough to kill a person and there is no antidote for it. The only way to save a victim is to keep them alive until the toxins stop working. Therefore, it is best not to touch these shells and avoid any confrontation with cone snails. Snails. Next up is another slow creature. Snails like sloths are completely harmless. They don't attack people, they don't hurt people, and so on, but only if people themselves do not disturb them. You don't want to touch a snail. No, it's not that it'll bite you or anything like that. Even though a snail has thousands of teeth, they're safe for humans. However, contact with a snail can have consequences. Many of these mollusks carry dangerous parasites, including flatworms called blood flukes. If a person picks up a snail and then puts their fingers in their mouth, they can get schistosomiasis, an acute parasitic disease. Its consequences are not pleasant, from fever, intoxication, and rash to damage to the intestines and other organs. Also, in places where the parasites and their eggs accumulate, blood vessels are clogged. This can lead to varicose veins, cysts, and tumors. Blood flukes can even cause cancer of certain organs, and all because of a simple touch to a snail. Anyway, be careful. Sloth Sloths are incredibly cute creatures that make us smile when we see them slowly crawling along the road or climbing trees. They are generally harmless and won't attack unless provoked. If they do, it's easy to walk or run away from them. However, it's important not to touch sloths as they can be dangerous. Their claws are up to three inches long and very sharp. If a sloth becomes angry, it can strike with its paw and cause deep cuts with its claws. Sloths don't like to be touched or disturbed without reason and can become aggressive if provoked. They can also use their teeth in conflicts. While they are not as sharp as a crocodile's or shark's teeth, they can still cause some harm. So it's best to admire these creatures from a distance and not interfere with them in any way. Raccoon. I don't know about you, but I think raccoons are some of the cutest creatures in the world. They have funny and interesting color, they're chubby and clumsy, and they beg for food funny. No wonder many people even have raccoons as pets. One won't get bored with them, and if there are no problems with domestic raccoons, you should definitely stay as far away from wild raccoons as possible. Don't forget that raccoons are predators. Yet they're small, so it's unlikely they'll be able to kill a human, but they can easily inflict wounds. But things are more dangerous if a raccoon is rabid. Raccoons get rabies more often than any animal in the world, except dogs. A rabid raccoon is incredibly dangerous like any other rabid animal. It'll lunge at people, bite them, and infect them with rabies. This disease becomes incurable and absolutely fatal the moment symptoms appear. So, after an attack by a rabid raccoon, immediate vaccination is needed. Distinguishing a rabid raccoon from an ordinary one is very easy. It behaves very strangely, stands on its hind legs, its muzzle shakes, it's afraid of light and water, and willingly comes out to people from the wild. Remember, only rabid animals do this. A healthy animal will never approach a person without a reason. Golden Poison Frog It's important to remember that some animals should not be touched because they can bite, sting, or scratch you, causing injury or disease. However, there's one animal that can't be touched at all because contact with it can be fatal, 
the golden poison frog. This beautiful and tiny yellow frog is one of the most poisonous animals in the world. Its venom is released through its skin, so it doesn't need to bite, sting, or scratch anyone. The golden poison frog's venom is called batrachitoxin, and it's extremely powerful. Even a tiny amount of the venom, just one five hundredth of a dose contained in the frog, is enough to kill an adult. So it's best to stay away from this yellow beauty, as well as other bright frogs known as poison dart frogs. While other poison dart frogs are less toxic, it's still dangerous to pick them up. Some people may do this for the sake of cool footage or experience, but it's not worth risking your health and life. Leopard Seal Look at this cute seal. Seems completely harmless, sleeping peacefully or just chilling. Many people would like to go up to it and pet it, but you definitely shouldn't do it. That's how it reacts to something like this. This is the leopard seal, and even though it looks cute when it's angry, people aren't in the mood for a smile. It's one of the most dangerous predators in Antarctica. There, it mercilessly massacres penguins as well as other seals. In battles, leopard seals dominate and spare no one. It can kill its prey with its teeth right on land, but more often it drags the prey to the depths where it easily deals with it. Sometimes these predators even mockingly play with their prey, like orcas. It's definitely not worth approaching such a dangerous beast. It's better to admire it from a distance, and when in a boat, you should be very vigilant. A leopard seal can suddenly surface, attack the boat, or even attack a person and drag them into the water. Blue Ringed Octopus Did you know that all octopuses are venomous? However, not all of them are deadly. The Blue Ringed Octopus is one of the most dangerous species of octopuses. It's quite small and has tentacles that are only 4 to 6 inches in length. The cephalopod itself is distinguished by its beautiful color. Many people are attracted to it and try to take it in their hands. But beware, all of them have literally held death in their hands. They're all very lucky to have survived. It's not only dangerous to pick up blue ringed octopuses, but even to touch them because they are incredibly venomous. Their venom contains potent tetrodotoxin, which is the same toxin found in the pufferfish from which the fugu dish is made. There's still no antidote for the venom, and sometimes the bite by a blue ringed octopus cannot even be felt. This is definitely not a creature to mess with. Hedgehog The hedgehog is another cute creature in this video. It's hard to be afraid of these small prickly creatures. So it's no surprise that many people are eager to get up close to them and hold them in their hands. I would definitely advise against this. First, a hedgehog may be frightened and then it will put its spines into fight mode. Getting pricked by these spines isn't the most pleasant thing that can happen, but it's still bearable. Another thing is that the hedgehog can carry a number of ticks and fleas, which can give a person pathogens of many terrible diseases. Some hedgehogs even carry the plague. Yeah, yeah, we're not in the Middle Ages, but there is still such a disease. By the way, under the influence of parasites, the hedgehog may begin to have metabolic disorders, so its spines may begin to fall out. So, noticing the lack of spines, it's worth bypassing the hedgehog's side and it's better to take hedgehogs in your hands, only in thick gloves. Beaver Beavers are known for being diligent and hard-working creatures. They usually focus solely on building their magnificent dams and don't pay attention to others. Therefore, it's important not to disturb them while they're working and definitely not to try to touch them. Beavers possess incredibly powerful teeth that can chew through even the toughest tree trunks. If provoked or threatened, an angry beaver will not hesitate to attack the offender. Since beavers have honed their teeth and jaws for chewing trees, biting a human can be quite easy for them and their bites can be quite severe. Moreover, beavers are known to carry rabies. In such cases, a beaver may actually approach and attack a person, which can lead to very serious consequences. Platypus. And finally, let's take a closer look at the platypus, one of the weirdest animals on the planet. Platypuses are known for their absurd and ridiculous appearance. Despite being mammals, they lay eggs and have electroreception, similar to electric eels. Additionally, they are venomous, which makes them undesirable to touch. However, they do not transmit their venom through a bite, 
but threw spurs on their hind legs. Male platypuses use these spurs during mating fights, but they can also use their venom for defense. Their toxins are capable of finishing off small animals, and while it is not fatal to humans, it is extremely painful and can last for months. So, which animal's ability surprised you the most? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching, and see you later.